Okay, look. I know I said the channel was going to be on hiatus, but a couple things happened. And a couple things are also going to happen. So I'm going to give you some, a backstory real quick. So my grandpa died in January. For those who may have not seen a few of my posts, my grandfather died in January. And since then, my grandmother has been trying to downsize and she finally bought a house. Depending on when this video goes up, I'm not even going to say when, so. But anyway, one weekend she asked me if I wanted to help her with a garage sale she, she was having. And this was a week prior to her buying the house, so. And of course I did. And I stayed with her for a couple of days and it was great. I loved it. And not only was that the good part, I also got a few things while I was there, which was really exciting. I ended up getting a Saskatchewan Rough Rider football shaped shot glass, which isn't really exciting, but I love it because it's rider merch and I collect rider gear for it. <laughs> I have too much in my closet, just ask my dad. And, um, I also got a couple hats, which was also cool. Those also aren't exciting. They're just a Team Sask and an Arizona hat. I'm not even sure what the hats are about, but they were my grandpa's. I also got this really cool leather bag from the 70s, which again, I know it isn't exciting to most people, but to me that is very exciting. Now, the reason I made this video, I got a vintage record player. I don't know if it's actually considered vintage, I don't know what is considered vintage or antique. That's research has got to be done. But I'm going to say vintage because I'm pretty sure anything older than the 70s is considered vintage. But I got this vintage record player from my grandmother. So my grandmother had kept a few things at my aunt's place and she found it when she was going through my aunt's storage room and asked me if I wanted it. Of course, me being me, I said yes. But here's the thing. I just got it a couple weeks ago. I have not looked at it yet. I have not opened it yet. I wasn't sure if I wanted to open it in my own time or if I wanted to open it on camera and share the experience. I wasn't sure. I thought about it ever since I got it. I've been thinking about it. And I said, why the heck not? Let's film a video. So I have in front of me, you cannot see it, but it is right in front of me. <laughs> this thing is very, very heavy as well. It is a 1966 General Electric record player. Again, I have not opened this thing yet. I have not seen it yet, I haven't seen what it looks like, but this thing is not just the record player, it also has speakers, so I cannot lift it because it is very, very heavy, but you guys will see in a minute that uh, the outside, I know that for a fact, the outside of this thing are actually the speakers, it comes with speakers and they're really old, so I'm going to move the camera, we're going to open this thing. Okay, so now you guys aren't going to see my face because, hi, but my face is not important. This is the important thing right here. So this is the record player. It doesn't look like much, but this thing right here, and it's also on the other side too, are the speakers. So I'm not sure which is the front and which is the back. <laughs> We're going to find out. I'm very excited to open this. I, again, I know I've said this a few times already, but I have not seen this thing yet. So I am very, very excited. So I see how to open it. I might have to tip it back. This thing is super cool. Oh my God. Okay, so there's nothing in there. Okay. Wow. Oh my God. I'm gonna turn this around. Look at this. Oh, the light. 
Look at that. I gotta hold on to this job. I'm scared to drop it. Look at that. Isn't that a beauty? I'm gonna bring the, hold on. I'm gonna do some. Here she is up close. This is upside down, so I'm gonna turn it. Look at that. I'm not sure what this thing is. So if somebody in the comments could tell me who knows more about like vintage stuff like this, that'd be amazing. Here's the, the, uh, I can't, I don't know what these parts are called. I'm still learning about it. I do know that the diamond needle on this is broken. I, that's what my grandma said to me. Here's how you turn it on. That's super cool. This thing is so old. It's so cool. The base, treble, balance, it, all the controls and stuff. Look how cool this is. Oh my god, this makes me so happy. Oh my god, this thing. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, this is like turning it on and off in the different speeds. 16. Oh, that's pretty slow. Oh my god, this thing is super cool. So I'm not sure if there's anything interesting on the back, but I'm going to open the back anyway. I just gotta make sure not to drop this thing, because this thing is very fragile and very old. It's starting to, like, kind of fall apart. Like, the... Whatever this is. Come on. Ugh. Okay, so it's just like, okay, there's the plug-in back here. Like, you guys can't really see it. Like, there's the plug-in. So, uh, like, my, my grandma told me this thing does turn on. Of course, I can't test if it works. And I'm not sure if there's any place in my city where I can get this thing fixed. Because I know it's just the, the diamond needle that needs repairing. But this thing is super cool. Also, I'm going to bring one of the speakers over here. Look at these things. Look how chunky these are. These are the speakers. Like, I can see inside. You guys can't really see inside, but, like, in the crevices, I can see the, like, wiring and whatnot for the speakers. I can see that they are speakers. And I'm not sure... Where can you plug them in? Oh, yeah. I see where you plug them in. There's the plug-in right there. This thing is super cool. Oh, so this is the back. So this goes like this. I know it's, like, really hollow in there. But it looks like, by the looks of it, I don't know how it stands. Okay, so this is upside down. Okay, I got it. So this is like what it looks like. This is what it would look like once it plugged in. I don't know, because I didn't see a cord in there for this. There was just the plug-in. But honestly, this thing is so neat. It is so freaking neat. Like, yeah, General Electric. I cannot remember what other appliances that General Electric makes. I don't even know if the company is still running anymore. I'm really curious what this thing is. So if you guys can figure out what this part is, I'm going to look it up later. If you guys can figure out what this thing is, I will love you guys forever. Oh my god, this thing is so cool. Oh my god. Oh, it's okay. Like, I have a record player currently. Like, I have one that works. Uh, made by one by one. Um, and it's amazing. It does kind of pitch the music I have a little bit, but it's super great. So, like, in comparison, these things are very different. So, I'm going to show you the comparison between this one and my current working one. Also, don't mind the desk. It's a little bit messy. I'm cleaning up in here. So, this is the one that works. It does play music. I have vinyls for it. And I've used it quite a few times. So, like, there's obviously still things I'm learning about this thing. So, you can tell, like, how different this is from the other one. Like, obviously, this one doesn't attach. It has its little clip that holds the hand in place there's also the speed and the auto stop and then down here are the controls so like the volume obviously i'm not sure about this thing yet i'll figure that out power seek record and then usb playback this thing is super cool i got it for christmas from my dad one year like 
look at the difference between this and that thing. This thing, I'm really stuck on what this thing is. I'll figure it out. So I know that this was a very short video, but that's really all I had planned. So I don't know if this was exciting for anybody else but me, but this is my favorite thing on the frickin' planet. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you guys made it to the end of the video, thank you for watching. Um, if you guys want to check me out on my other socials, links in the description. And all of you have a wonderful day. Bye!